Hey you guys, it's me. Um, I'm gonna make dinner. Today I decided to make, how's everybody doing first of all? Hope everybody's fine, I'm fine. Um, I'm doing fine, just a little down. Some stuff happened with uh, my sister and me taking care of my mom. My mom's fine, um, just some disagreements. So I pray that the Lord fix that if it's his will. Um, just small disagreements that shouldn't even matter. Just, you know, when you got one person that's selfish, you know, it is what it is. So I'm, I'm trying to be beyond that. Just, just stuff that don't even matter. Just, you know, people always playing the victim. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. Today, um, I'm going to make some baked ziti um, for my husband, for us for dinner, so we can <clears throat> eat off of that for um, a few days. Okay, right now I have in the. I already started the ground turkey. I'll turn that. I'll turn it around so you guys can see it. Okay, there's the ground turkey cooking. I just started. Just put it on, and so what I'm going to put in there is um, I'm going to use this. Prego sauce, okay. Um, some garlic, garlic. Uh, what's that? Minced garlic. Um, bell peppers. I've never put bell peppers in there before, but my husband said, hey, "Let's try some bell peppers." So why not? Um, complete seasoning. This stuff is so good. If you haven't tried that, try it. You guys will love it. And the noodles I'm going to use is rigatoni, okay. And I also got some. Um, garlic spread here and some bread so i'll make some garlic bread okay so my daughter must be here look at the dog look look y'all look at him he goes crazy when my daughter's here anyway um who is it baby who is it who is it timmy fell down the well okay so i'm gonna open the door let her in look at this this is ridiculous Yep, and she is here. So those are all the ingredients that I'm going to use. So I'm just cooking this um, brown turkey. I need to cut these bell peppers, and I will in a second. Oh, you want some? You want some raw turkey? Hi guys. Where are you coming from? Work. Yeah. Ten hour shifts. Yep. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good jazz. Don't what she said. Alright. The dog needs to go for a walk. Half and half probably. Red and green. Mm. What's the first? Okay, I had to get my pot of water for the noodles. I'm gonna put that on right now. Stop that right now. I'll put a little oil in here. So...
onions in there. I got the garlic. I'm probably about to put the bell peppers in there just so I can get the sauce rolling. Because I don't put too much stuff in my, I might, and I have these bell peppers. I'm gonna throw in there too. It tastes, um, I never tried it with bell, I just put the bell peppers in there, see? Okay, you guys, I switched the meat into a bigger pot because I'm already knowing this is going to be, um, I have to put the sauce in there and I want to make sure that I have an, uh, enough room. So, y'all, this is my little onion container. I forgot where I bought it, but I probably need another one because this is a, this is cracked, but isn't that cute? Oh, yeah. Okay, this is, I'm going to put the sauce in there now, and I'm not going to use all the sauce, you guys. So, hold on. Okay, that's the meat sauce. I'm probably going to add some more sauce to it. Yeah, I am. That's the meat sauce for that, but I'm going to add some more sauce, so... Did I get anything? Nope. Okay. Oh, I didn't check. It's okay. Oh, is the package? Yeah. Okay. okay. Probably that book he was waiting on. That's the sauce. My water's boiling. See that? Yeah, I had to cover that up. That was splattering. <laughs> this sauce. And it's hot. So I'm going to add my rigatoni to the water because it's already boiling. And I put a little uh, olive oil in there. A little bit of bacon. That ain't too much. So I'm going to add the rigatoni to this. I don't know why. I might not need the whole box, but we'll see. I'm just going to stir it up. And I'm only going to cook these rigatonis to their own. Um, al dente because it's going to cook the rest of the time it's going to cook in the um in the um in the oven take the acidity away you guys I'm just going to put a little bit of sugar. Maybe a tablespoon and a half. Maybe, yeah, maybe a tablespoon and a half. Stir it up and then I'm going to taste it. Make sure it's... That it don't need more sugar or brown sugar or whatever. I might put a little. Well, you know what? I think it's good. I'm, I'm not gonna make it too sweet. You know? I think that's good. While that's cooking, I will. You guys, I keep my cast iron. My Dutch oven in here already in my oven, so I have to remove those when I get ready to cook. So I'll preheat my oven 350. Make sure that's all that's in there. I'll start that. And while that's preheating, while that's preheating, I'll come over here and start cleaning up.
because I don't want it really salty. But this is what it's looking like. Bake ziti, y'all. Bake ziti. Let me see. Maybe this is. Hold on. Let me see if this light will show. That's the baked ziti. Okay, with the bell peppers. So I'm going to put that in the oven for a little bit. And then I'm going to clean up this mess and start on these dishes. This is the garlic bread. It's not cooked yet. So I'm just waiting for the stuff to come out, the um, baked ziti to come out the oven. And I will put this in. All right. Okay, you guys, this is my plate for the baked ziti. I just got a little bit and a piece of garlic bread. Um, and I'm going to put a sprinkle some parmesan cheese on top but that's what it looked like okay you guys thank you for joining me today while i made dinner baked ziti and garlic bread have a nice evening stay safe pray for each other god bless later or i'm gonna eat this popsicle later